yeah, welcome everybody. I'm glad you hope you have a fun time. I'm Judy Bowman. I'm an in-law. I'm married to Linda's brother, Gary, and that's how I know Jim. And we're here to wish Jim a very happy birthday and God's blessing. Thank you. Uh, I've known Jim for about 13 years since my sister Linda started dating him. I'm Gary Bowman. I'm Linda's brother. And uh, you know, we get together with them on holidays and occasionally and just enjoy their fellowship. Happy birthday, Jim. Yes. 60 isn't that old. You're okay. Bye. <laughs> That's my dog. Linda. Yes. Jim's my brother. Happy birthday, Jim. Yes. Happy birthday, Jim, first of all. And I know Jim and Linda because I was doing the Siebel Bible study. And they both attended my study and connected. So, and my word of advice for them is to Jim always honor Linda, treat her as God would love you and treat you, and you're going to continue to have a happy marriage. Happy birthday, Jim! <laughs> Hi, um, my name is Carrie Thomas and my husband Steve is behind Ray here and we know Jim and Linda from church and uh, through small group and uh, they've become good friends of ours and we just want to wish him a very happy 60th birthday and many, many blessings. Great guy, beautiful wife, we went to her 60th and now we're back to his and just having a good time I hope. All right, Jim, and uh, what are you trying to find here for your 60th birthday? What, what now? What are you trying to find over here? What's, what's I'm trying to stop my bleeding. Oh, my goodness. Uh, oh, no, I didn't want to help. That's terrible. <laughs> and who's this? Uh, this is Linda. Linda's husband. And who's this lovely person? Hi. <laughs> I'm your wife. Yeah. How did you, how did you know Jim? Um, through you. Because <laughs> it's your friend. And he's my friend too. Happy birthday and God bless you. Thank you for inviting me. <laughs> hey Jim, I gotta put on these glasses so I can look 10 years younger. You might want to do this more often. You just get these cool shades. Watch, 10 years younger I'm gonna look. I'm like 42. I'm gonna look 32. Wow. Bam! 32. You're 60, put on shades, you'll look 50. Just remember that. That's, that's what I gotta tell you. And happy birthday, thank you so much, Jim. This is just really good Italian. It's gonna be a great time. But I just wanna continue to tell you, be anxious for nothing but in everything by prayer and petition, giving thanks to God. And the peace of God that surpasses all understanding will guard your heart and your mind. And maybe that'll help not getting that razor cut. Yeah, that's a tough one there, buddy. This side it works just fine. All right, now we got a band-aid on Jim. So. And, uh, Is that better? Let me get a close up of what's yeah, happening. Oh, that's here. terrible, though. All right, Linda, how do you know Jim? And uh... <laughs> well, I know Jim better than anybody here. <laughs> I well, mean, there you go. And, and, and I just, go ahead. I just want to wish him a happy 60th birthday. Hope all his wishes come true, and uh, that God will continue to bless him. And thank you for all the wonderful friends that have come to this party. All right, to the rescue here. <laughs> Well, I'm Nancy, and I've known Jim and Linda since before they were married. They met at the Seagulls Group in church, and started from there. So it's been 15, 16 years, something like that, that I've known them, and watched them get married, and just had a best time since. They've been good friends and dear friends to help me out when I've had surgeries, and they've gone to the hospital and clinics to wait for me. So. It's been a blessing to meet them and know them we brought them together. Happy 60th to you, Jim. I just turned 60 a month ago, so it's been a great year so far. So have a great day and a great year. Let me see, Jim. Did you say it stopped already? I think like it stopped. Let me see. I'll, I'll check in the close-up on the camera and see if it stopped. Stop. Hey, it looks better. All right. I've known Jim for quite a little bit. Um, I met him through a Bible study. And happy birthday. 
Hi, my name is Arlene, and I know Jim from church. Uh, we used to go to uh, Bonita Valley Christian Center together, and that's how I know him. And uh, I was actually with him and Linda when they got married. My husband and I stood up with them, and they were their little couple that they had to witness their wedding. And we just had a great time. And we've done things with them through the years. We have dinners with them every three months with other friends, and we just have a great time with them. They're a great couple. Happy birthday, Jim. Have a great day. This is Mark Hubbard. We met at a Bonita Valley Community Church, and uh, we've been friends ever since. They were at our wedding, and then we uh, were at theirs. And we've always uh, been good friends with them. Happy birthday, buddy. <laughs> How do I know him? Well, it's rather personal and private and <laughs> security. You can feel we'll talk about it in confession. <laughs> Happy birthday, Jim. Father, we uh, thank you that we can come together and celebrate Jim's 60th birthday. We pray a special blessing on him that uh, you'll guide him, direct him, bless him in the coming years. Enjoy this decade of his life and bless him and Linda and their marriage whatever they take to do. We thank you for this time together here. church and we also went to FMO group and just want to wish you a happy birthday brother. Uh, thanks for being an awesome brother. Um, you're always a good participator in the group and you're always just been an awesome brother when I talk to you man. So I uh, hope you enjoy this uh, this 60 year birthday brother. I know Jim um, from my husband Edward and before my husband and I would see him around at church as well. So I'm familiar with Jim. <laughs> happy birthday Jim. God bless all of you and thank you very much for this oh, I, wonderful uh, birthday. I gotta get it closer because it's back. <laughs> Am I bleeding again? Am I bleeding again? So the fishies, I love the fishies. Man, they are perfect. Now if I Cassandra, I bet. Well, there's a trick to this, huh? Jim. 
Jim, yeah.